and hello YouTube. So, as I mentioned in my last video, when I was the short video showing the um, new Monarchy armor, excuse me, the Future Warcult armor set, I did say that we'd have a look at the Titans new Monarchy armor set, which I think is actually just as cool. Now, this is the original shader without. This is original colour, no shaders applied. The red and white, the red, red and white's nice, but this red and white to me is a little bit faded, a little bit washed. Uh, but I've got to say, man, I, I was wasn't that keen on the helmet to start with, but I've really come to like it. But two things I like in particular is a the colour coordination with the uh, new monarchy logo embedded on the helmet, on the chest piece, on the right hand side leg. And how they've separated the, the white and red looks quite nice. But I've got to say, it's it's the furry collar and the fur on the left shoulder. It just looks like a commander set, doesn't it? That a general would wear. You'd, all the troops would look the same, same armor set, but the general has the fur collar to, to distinguish himself as the leader. So I've got to say, this and the the Future War Cult sets are really some of my favorites. So let's have a quick look at these in color. So the two that I, I really like, um, again, the Cyrus Minimalist. You've seen it from the... Future War Cult set, but the the white and red is, is changed locations here, but it's so vibrant that is what I like about it. The vibrancy of those colours, they really pop out. But again, that time just looks bad. Badass. It just looks badass. That's all, that's all, all I can say, really. It looks badass. Um, you do not want to run into this guy in a dark alleyway, do you? You know what I mean? So I've got to say, the Cyrus Minimalist is one of my favourite shaders, I think, on most of the armour sets. If we have a look at the uh, Blacksmith, again, this this works really well. It's got a matte finish, and, and it's something I don't use. I don't I don't really wear this full set because, admittedly, my helmet and my arms are only 304 apiece. The chest and legs are high. but So I'm trying to, obviously, I mix and match my armour to try and get the higher drops as possible so I don't wear these, but as soon as I'm able, I will be wearing full sets. But I've got to say, the Blacksmith art, uh, shader looks absolutely great. Um, that grey matte finish with that yellow just works beautifully, doesn't it? And let's have a quick look at my other one of my other favourite Autumn Splendors. I'm not sure how this works on this character. Not bad. Not great. I don't know. It, everything seems to work apart from the helmet, don't you think? You, you, the dark blue shows the dust on the helmet from all the fighting has been in, or you know that matte finish. But it actually looks like dust on the helmet. But I don't know about that that logo on the helmet in orange. It just looks a little bit out of place there. Uh, we can have a quick look at the uh, at the feud on fading. No, not great, not great. This 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 shader did work on some of my armor sets, but I can't remember which ones. So I'll have a quick look at debt unpaid. That's okay. That's not bad. I like the grey and red. You know, that's a slightly different grey from the blacksmith shader. Um, you know, that, that's not too bad at all. And we go back to the original. Again, the original, it's a little bit too washed for me. So it's got to be, it's got to be the uh, Cyrus Minimalist, I think. I think that one does it for me. So anyway, that is the new Monarchy full set, pre-April update. And as I mentioned, as I collect the new versions of the armour, the new designs, I will, once I have the full sets, I will put them back on my... All my characters, I will show Warlock, I will show Hunter, I will show Titan. Uh, as soon as I get all the faction package sets, I will show you guys. So anyway, thank you very much for watching this short video on armor sets, and I'll see you next time. So cheers!